Ladies and gentlemen, this is Shamrock FC 285, and tonight, somebody's going down. Let's bring out our next bout of the evening, Stephen Coleman. Coming to the cage right now, it is Jordan Hernandez. We actually had a fight fall off, ladies and gentlemen. It happens in the world of mixed martial arts sometimes, but it's all about fighter safety. So the fight with Stephen Coleman versus his opponent has been called off as we Stephen Coleman and Travis Sumler That's is the it. fight that fell off. Travis Sumler had an, an issue with his eye. He could not fight tonight. Now we move on to uh, Jordan Hernandez. Jordan Hand Hernandez comes to us by way of his own gym, Hernandez MMA. The former college wrestler has been doing well-rounded work in daily training camps. He told me that he has got to stay calm in this one. He needs to stick to his game plan and try to keep this fight standing. Let's bring out his opponent tonight, Stephen Graham. Coming to the cage tonight by way of American Top Team HD and KCBJJ, it is Stephen Graham. Now the Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu purple belt, as you see, he is wearing it here on his neck. Worked a lot on his stand-up for this. As we go to our tail of the tape, Jordan Hernandez, 23 years old, 5'7", 142 pounds, out of Antioch, Illinois. Stephen Graham, 26 years old, 5'7", 139 pounds, out of Kansas City, Missouri. It's gonna be a great matchup, Jeremy. Jeremy, both guys have been working on their stand-up. Both guys are pretty good on the ground. You know, I think these guys are very evenly matched in both of their strong suits you know, kind of match up. They're both good on the ground. They both need to work on their scene up. That's exactly what both of, them, both of them have been doing. This comes down to one of those, when it is a Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu practitioner versus a wrestler, who cancels each other out in the match? Ladies and gentlemen, tonight, fighting out of the blue corner this evening, he stands five feet, seven inches tall. He weighs in at 142 pounds. Fighting out of Antioch, Illinois, Jordan Hernandez. His opponent tonight, fighting from across the cage out of the red corner this evening. He stands five feet, seven inches tall. He weighs in at 100 and 39 pounds, fighting out of Kansas City, Missouri, Stephen Gray! <laughs> Referee Mike England has this call for this contest. It is our first fight on the main card tonight. Jeremy Johnson along with my partner Kevin Engel live from Ameristar Casino in Kansas City, Missouri for Shamrock FC 285. And here we go, Stephen Graham in the red taking on Jordan Hernandez in the blue. Oh, big head kick right away from Stephen Graham. Just misses. Looks like Hernandez is working for a guillotine but he does not have full guard. Almost impossible to finish from that position here. He needs to at least lock, try to lock up here into half guard. Graham doing a good job here of defending, starting to land some shots into the ribs, pushing down on those hands. Yeah, Jordan uh, Hernandez has let go of that guillotine, kind of just holding on to Graham, trying to get position. Now back to full guard for Jordan Hernandez. Definitely body shots here coming from Graham. We can hear those all the way here over in the broadcast booth. Heavy pressure here coming out of Graham as he is holding Hernandez up against the cage and really working to soften up those ribs. Yeah, by Graham keeping Hernandez head on the cage, he's not letting Hernandez kind of work his guard. He's not letting him work any offense from the bottom.
heavy, heavy pressure here coming out of Graham. Jordan Hernandez is in a harsh position here, having to keep that head pressed up against the cage, not able to work his shoulders. Now trying to move away to try to get some stand-up or to at least work to some sort of submission. Yeah, Hernandez had both feet on the hips. He needed to push off while he could have. Now Graham doing a good job passing into side control. But Hernandez has the underhook on the far side. Hernandez needs to turn into Graham. He has the underhook. He needs to turn into him. Nice hammer fist from the bottom from Hernandez, but that's not the position you want to be in. No. Heavy, heavy knee on belly position here from Stephen Graham. It's doing a lot of work. Now he's looking for a submission of his own here. A nice reversal from Hernandez. Good sweep from Hernandez. Graham looking for the guillotine. Hernandez defends well. Hernandez now looking for a takedown of his own. Now but Graham, Graham is, might have that guillotine. Graham is working for this submission here. He is working hard in this position. And he and gets he a tap. Taps out Jordan Hernandez. Great job by Stephen Graham. Recognize he had the guillotine. Sits back and finishes it from half guard. Beautiful job from Stephen Graham. Big win, adding another notch in the win column. Here is Stephen Graham. As we look here at our instant replay, he ties up that crank and it just absolutely is working that choke. Good show of jujitsu here. Yeah, very nice. It was kind of a modified hand position which is exactly what he had to do to finish that choke. Great job by Stephen Graham. As we send it up to our ring announcer, Stephen Bear. Ladies and gentlemen, this bout has ended two minutes and 30 seconds of round number one. Your winner by guillotine choke out of the red corner, Stephen Graham! All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am here with your winner, Stephen Graham. Now, Stephen, very nice display of jujitsu there. Did you ever feel threatened at all in this fight? Uh, he can hit hard from the bottom. Uh, I was highly shocked at how hard he hit from the bottom. But no, I was never, I was never threatened. I wanted to take him down and I wanted to beat his ass. And I wanted to beat him until, until he gave me something and he eventually gave me something. So when you felt that submission come, how deep was it? Oh, it was all the way there. I wouldn't let it go. I wanted to make sure the rep pulled me out before I let go of anything. I was squeezing until he tapped or passed out. All right, ladies and gentlemen, your winner, Stephen Graham.